Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Civil Engineering Classes. In this video, we will learn about limits, how to set the limits and how to work on it. So let's see. Here I have opened my AutoCAD software. I am using 2016 version. The working area which you can see here is unlimited in all the four sides. So whenever you are drawing something, it's necessary to set limits for your working area. So that you can see the only required portion of the sheet. So let's see how to give limit. Shortcut command for limit is L I N enter. Now here in command line you will get instructions specify lower left corner. Now lower left corner will specify 0 comma 0 that is origin point. Now specify upper right corner. Upper right corner depends upon the area of your drawing. If the total dimension of your drawing is 100 mm by 100 mm, then giving some extra space around the drawing will have to give extra dimension that is 200 mm by 200 mm. So the upper right corner will give 200, 200. Enter. Now here your limits are set. To explain you this in a better way, we'll give you an example. Suppose you want to draw a plan on an A3 size paper. The size of A3 paper will be 297 by 420mm. So what we will do is, we'll draw a rectangle of A3 size. We'll take a rectangle. We'll give dimensions as 420 enter 297 now here is your AC size rectangle we'll give limits now Com give command L I N enter specify this as lower left corner and specify this as upper right corner now here your limits are set to see this limit will give command zoom all. Shortcut key for zoom all is Z enter A enter. Now you can see here your whole working area has come under your limit. Now when you draw something in this limit you can draw within this limit and you can also draw outside this limit area. Suppose, if you don't want to draw anything outside this limit area, then what you have to do is, give limit command. Now here, you will get this option on and off. You press on on, now your limit will be active. When you will draw something, you can draw within this area. But when you try to draw something outside this area, it won't happen. You can't draw anything outside this limit. So, if you want to draw outside the limit, then you give limit command and put off this limit. So that you can draw anything outside also. So hope you all have understood how to set the limit and why it is useful. If you like this video then please like and subscribe our channel to learn more about AutoCAD. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.